All right, folks, the deck is Mechathune Rogue. The goal of the deck is to use Unk of the Buried to reduce the cost of Mechathune to one, eventually working our way towards Myra's Unstable Element into Secret Passage, play the Mechathune, followed by an animated broomstick. Um, and as long as this, as long as the... As long as our hand is in the Secret Passage and our hand is empty after the Secret Passage, we can complete the Mechathune combo. If you're watching this on YouTube, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. You can catch me live at twitch.tv slash raffle. Oof. Gonna need some cuts on that one. <laughs> so what's new on that deck? Uh, the new cards are new. this uh keep the anka Shiny finder on two is good i just want to have an answer like evasion is, like good to have but not necessarily good to have it on turn one you want cards that like move and so like the shiny finder is good cloak is very good as well not necessarily on curve I can trade the Cutlass, um, reduce the cost of some of these spells. I can trade the Extortion if I don't uh, need to kill the cannon. <laughs> well, huh. I guess that just happened. You can save the Extortion now. To deal with the captain. I don't know if that was worst worth. But I can use the first secret passage next turn. Eventually. Another like evasion isn't actually bad here, is it? Go here, here. Big cards that uh, draw me more cards still. This counts. I can't use the second one. Okay. That's good to have. I've got a second broom. I could uh, just pitch this one. That increases its cost when it goes back, but this does not. Like, I could even consider just yellowing the uh, Myra's next turn. Just coin evasion Myra's. Coin extortion evasion Myra's. And just hope that I hit the pieces I need.
I feel like I have to take a risk here. It's one piece. Need the Megathune. I'm out of cards. I give up. Uh, it was winnable if I hit the Megathune. Without any card draw, though, it felt, like, necessary to take that risk. Because it was going to be hard to find the combo in time for it to matter. Might have been too hasty on the first, uh, cloak. Valir versus the Thunder King! I'm the slayer of kings and gods. I make my own luck. None of these are card draw. It's tempting to keep the uh, prep, but I didn't really have anything to prep. So. Would have had a swindle, but also the last card I hit off of the mulligan, so. Job done. to clear this. This should be a slow enough matchup that I can stave off their aggression. Those aren't terribly threatening. This is good to have, but need a combo activator for both of these. You gotta take this off the board, right? This? Okay, next turn is Evasion Minstrel. some damage. It is a Mechathune. There once was a man from the old Action Jackson. Okay, we've got two pieces. Three pieces. Just need the Anka now. Some time. So many options. 
I also need them unstable. Bid starts at 200 gold. World first auctioneer Jackson. A fair trade. Fortunately, this alone is not going to do it. Gonna start scaling out of control. Fizzle oh. Jizzix, thank you for the 16 months. 16 months, and I really haven't been able to catch the stream at least the last four. Hope you're doing well, Ralph Lamb. Thank you. Hope you are too. Thank you for that support. Ugh. Oh no. Okay, I need evasion off the top. Close. Yeah. Gotta go fishing. for next turn um can go here and Lanka. but i still then need just the secret passage but i should be able to get the secret passage off of the myras right i think i can get there if i have enough mana oh god Five, six, seven. And then, yeah, we win. So I just need to dump this to make sure I have hand space. I'm going to burn two cards, it looks like. No, I just go here, here, here. Play the secret passage. Where's Flare when you need it? Flare would not do anything here. There are no minions that are stealthed. Away. Oh, it was the secret passage animation. <laughs> I was like, <laughs> I was confused about that for a moment. Oh my god, that was a. <laughs> That was an absolute nail biter. Joe, thank you for the 11 months.
Is this deck bait, or can I play it to climb Legend in Wild? Um, I don't know. I've played two games with it, but it's probably not great. There are much better decks to climb to Legend with. I make my own luck. Defo bait? I mean, bait would suggest, like, I built this get deck with the intention of being good, right? Like, I'm not out here trying to convince people this deck is tier one. It's just a fun deck. Excuse me, Garrosh. You seem to have forgotten your quest. If a deck plays Mechathun, don't climb to Legend with it. Tell that to Mechathun Druid. That's good for next turn. Probably questless pirate warrior. Yeah, I think you're onto something here. There once was a man from Action Jackson. Nice. With some tradable cards. Seems good. You guys are all wrong. It's just Frost Giant uh, Warrior, clearly. Feels kind of bad, but I do just want to use my mana here. I'm going to do some trading next turn. And try and find the Anka, or maybe another Minstrel. Secret Passage is good. That's one combo piece. Here's the Anka. I'm beginning to think this might not be a fair trade. That's actually a really good Jackson. Huh. It is Recruit Warrior. Ah! <laughs> no, you can wait a little bit longer, Gromash. It's fine. It's fine. Just wait. But then he dies. There once was a man from Gilneas. Okay, there's the two remaining combo pieces. I just need the Myras now. Here and I'm fine with it.
Okay, I've got two trade, three tradable cards left, but that's pretty much my only draw. <laughs> I do have a like the second secret passage is also technically playable. So I could use that. I mean, I could also use the first one if I really wanted to. I'm gonna trust that they're not just running a bunch of charge minions. I considered freezing or killing that and then freezing it, but it felt kind of like a waste of the freeze. I don't know how many more turns I need here. Could also just hit the Myras off of the top and that would be neat. turn here. This hero power lol. Oh, okay. Seems a little risky with the grunts and the recruits, but can't knock someone for trying new cards. Wouldn't Lord Kelp keep her pole kelp be good in this deck? Huh. I mean, sometimes. That's five mana that you have to allocate to it, but... I've run him in previous versions and he's been okay. Cool. Uh, that's game. Consistently draw the combo pieces. No, I'm a, I'm aware what uh, Polka does. I just I don't know. Jack's doing fine without him. You already have to allocate five mana to uh, the Anka, so you would have to play. You'd have to play Polka theoretically. Play Polka, wait, then play Anka, or then draw Anka after you draw the Megathune, and it also, no. Now that I think about it, Polka would be terrible in this deck because we're running a lot of tradable cards. It's just too good a card not to keep. I'm gonna keep the extortion. Uh, it's good into a shadow priest, and I can just trade it. Uh, this is good on three. Yeah. Well, welcome to the danger zone, chat. Thank you. 
Uh, this would have only saved me one point of damage. Or zero points, two points of damage at most. That would have been good. So what the extortion is for. This please. Perfect. Get an activator for the minstrel next turn. Actually doing all right. We're at 24. I mean that can that life total can go quickly against Shadow Priest, but like I've still got cloaks and stuff. Cloak is not great there if they have no mind blast, fight. but Only power. Nothing gets past. Oh. Yeah, this turns out to be a waste of evasion, so I don't think I can play it. Just have to give up the prep. One, two, maybe I hit a plunder. Could have actually saved health with the evasion. Jeez. I mean, I'm taking this damage at some point, right? I have to... Myra's? I don't see a way out here. So many options. Like I have to, but like still just kind of die without. Yeah, there's no. I'm out of cards. Unless they botch this somehow. But even then, like the fatigue is what gets me. Yeah, I didn't botch it. What? You had the combo pieces. This is coming from the person that just said... Seriously, sometimes people, you and people in chat make me doubt if you are take, talking seriously or just trolling. Were you facing a mirror when you said that? No, I'm talking seriously? Okay. I had the combo pieces, but I was dead. Cat, I give her the five gifted subs. Six gifted subs. Sorry about that.
It's a good hit. But I still do more cards. Well, and I just need the Anka. Is it worth to coin this out? No. Because I, like, I don't actually think I want it to soak up a... Uh... Going to watch? Okay, we can take a look. I don't know if I had the mana. No, I only had seven mana, and I would have had to make an eight mana play. So you're wrong. Just check the replay for you. You're welcome. In the box? Mm, pirate stuff. Fly, party. Haven't tuned into stream in a while. Don't remember you being so condescending. I was responding in kind to a comment that they just said about literally everyone else in chat. So why should I be kind to them if they're going to be a dick to everyone else? <laughs> and I'm doing the same to you right now. Hey, Isengarden. Do I take seven here? But at least I have an answer to the captain now. Fly, party. Does Cutlass reduce the cost of a spell you just draw? It can, yes. Uh, looking kind of dead here. off of this. I need a broom. Missed. I'm out of cards. It's still possible to win from here. I can't do that. I can't You can't do that when you can't trade when your deck's empty? Do I have a way to break the Mechathun, though? 
I thought I've been able to trade when it's empty before. I have the extortion. I need to save the extortion. Um, somehow I also need to... I need to use this next turn. No, I, I don't have the, the mana for this. I just die in fatigue. Uh, I, it was possible if I hit the broom, but not... Uh, not with having to like pace out my turns to empty hand. Minstrel. I don't think I can keep the action Jackson, unfortunately. I can double coin the Minstrel as well. Prep Swindle, double coin Minstrel. Pretty fast. Second Minstrel. That makes hits off the first. A little bit more reliable. That's not bad either. Okay. Um, yeah. In the I box? might even just go with this first. Yeah. Away! Dear God. Maybe an anchorless warrior from Reddit? Uh, I think with this opener. It does not seem to be that, but uh, I mean, there's not really any way that we can tell. Okay. This is fine. Got coin. Oh. So it's probably better for me. At least I had to trade. I'll clear this at least. The problem, however, is that they still get the four damage this turn, right? No, they haven't even drawn a weapon. In the box? Pirate stuff. Cannon shots are pretty brutal for me. The turn that they do come down, they're guaranteed to hit my face. All but guaranteed to hit my face. Can't clear that. Not having the back there in hand is pretty brutal right now. I'm 
sorry, what? Blood and blunder. That's not good order. Maybe the menstrual can suck up one. There we go. Actually, very good for me. I'd have an easier time against um, Questline Hunter than Pirate Warrior. The only problem with potential problem with Questline Hunter is like having something to attack into. But I feel like Tavish is usually something to attack into. It's just like I don't deal with boards very well. I think I need a source of three damage in case it's Murlocs, and then, like, if it's not, I just trade it. Monka is a card. I'm gonna hang on to this for a turn. It's probably worth uh, being able to deal with an angler. Here for a they are Morgul, after all. No, doesn't seem to be Murlocs. Trade this. Also trade this. Job done. Well, I've got my defensive stuff, but that's not what I need right now. Old action Jackson. And nothing to trade at the moment. this. Most of my cards are good here and things like this I can just dump them so that I don't draw them in the future. Whoops. Maybe I shouldn't have even played the blunder either. But I did get rid of quite a few cards. I didn't need to play the Blunderer because it was coming back to hand. So oh, I can see it even without Brumio Extortions in hand. I was taking Fatigue and I was at 9 against Pirate Ward. And I hadn't played Monkey yet, so I was dead. And I had to play 10 cards. an OTK Shaman? Yeah, it's probably just burn Shaman with uh, Drek'thar as a fetch. Did Shatter no quest? No, they played way too many. But it's it's just burn shaman. Uh, people are I think I saw Martian running this list yesterday. It's it's just burn shaman with Drekthar to hit the. Oh, 
the spirit. Bro. Nothing gets past me. Uh, I needed to draw there so that I would get closer to the Cloak of Shadows because I need another turn most of the time. Doing a really good job of. the evasions. <laughs> I think it's very unlikely I'm not dead here. I'm and I'm sure chat will yell at me if I concede, so I'll just play it out. Set the timer. We'll see how much of my life I wasted. Huh, not too long. We should be fine matchup. Unless it's aggro. Saw this encounter. I make my own luck. I need card draw still. Prep is tempting, but I think I can't get stuck with a hand like this is what I was trying to avoid, but like Previous hand was kind of more of the same. Guys, play nice. We don't need to be mean to each other. Just let each other have opinions. Big priest. That should be free. <laughs> I, I shouldn't have said that, should I? <laughs> I'm not drawing very well, unfortunately. I don't want to punch them. I don't want a secret passage this turn. I might soon, though. I don't hit draw. The storm oh. No okay. I mean, John, you're doing the same thing though. You're not. <laughs> you're. You're. You have tunnel vision as well. That's that's the problem. Is that you're both just arguing your own point of view and refusing to hear the other person's. John, stop! Everybody, stop! Let it go. Move on. Yeah, I mean, 
means I can give away a broom. Stop. Everybody stop. Just move on. Uh, even though it's not Big Priest because of Vandar, it's still like a minion based deck, right? So that's kind of fine. I think I can play this now. Trade, trade. Not great hits, unfortunately. Uh, I just need this out of my deck. Just gave them some quest progress, but... I mean, as soon as I hit the Swindles and Minstrels, I'm, uh... Good night. It's alright, John. Don't worry about it. Tradesies. I mean, they're bound to play cards, eventually, minions eventually, right? Where? Where's my card draw? I don't want to keep hitting them. How's Jackson plus four trades felt as an engine? Uh, it's been really good once. I'm sorry, why are we playing Vandar in Big Priest? I won this. There's also a Yashira and a Blood in this deck. It's kind of bad for me. I haven't hit a single bit of card draw. Remember when I said this matchup was free? Yeah, they're running Vandar plus Yashira plus Blood of Gahoon. Plus Vargon. I mean, if I hit a... Okay. I was going to say, if I hit a Myra's, I can just combo. <laughs> I mean, it's still true, but... I gave up a coin. I think I can go on turn 10, right? Because I can Mechathune coin counterfeit, or I count coin animated broomstick. That's pretty good. Next turn, I go prep, broom, Prize Plunderer, Myra's. You could even just like prep the Myra's in case I hit the. Uh... Okay, let me. Ma I need to get rid of all of the cards that cost mana from my hand. Uh... Dreamcast Gamer. I give you the prime. I actually don't want to draw that many cards, do I? Although I need no, I do need to draw cards because I need a 
cloak or something. Unless I just hit it off the top. Oh god, we hit it. Prep this. Prep this. And then play everything else. Gonna be close. I'm out of cards. We did it. I need because this, uh, this will do it. I almost botched it because I forgot about the, uh, the fact that Megathun's still a 10-10, but the, the fact that they're running um, Statue saves me. Or the fact that they just did that. <laughs> That's Megathun, Coin, Broom. Nothing in the res pool but Vandar. <laughs> oh my god. This deck is not good for my blood pressure. Action Jackson was actually uh, pretty good there for fetching the um, fetching the Myras when I needed it. Yeah. This opponent is absolutely playing Pirate Warrior, I can assure you of that. They're just in full roleplay mode right now. right now I can go here trade this and then kill like a cannon with this Grab your cutlass. Let's or just a 2-2 two -two. Uh, that depends on what we top deck though because this could hit a different spell than the evasion then. Yeah, I think so. Ugh. Okay. I think that's fine. I can coin the Anka next turn. Trust 
Nope, need to need to extort them. God, what a great attack line. Okay. Um, I'm going to actually rip the Seeker Passage here. I need more than the hand that I currently have. Whoa! <laughs> yeah, this is a good choice. Great choice. Oh, my God. Well. A fair trade. I feel like them going face there gave me a bit of a chance that I didn't have before. What do I need? I need Broom and Myra's. And I've got time thanks to the cloak. Did we even play the Cutlass once yet? Yeah, I had to play it last game because of the... Um, uh, because I did the combo the hard way. No, Jackson! Oh, I miss her already, chat. The broom. What's going on with my hand? My Cthune is <laughs> really struggling right now. Okay. Um... Seven, do I ever die from I need this because I need to be a cloak next turn to deny the Rokara hitting me in the face for seven. And the rest of the board that's just there now. And the bigger weapon that they're going to have. So. Wait, I just need the Myra's. And I've got a, at least a turn with the uh, cloak here. I keep trading. Find the Myra's. Not quite. I cannot play this. Evasion's pretty good. Um, but it's actually just, if I top deck Myra's here, I win. It's exactly okay, the mana that I need. Powder. Oh my god, are you kidding me? I can buy another turn with evasion. There's no outs. So close. I give up. Hey, Odin son. Oh man, that was so close. I mean, that's about as close as I have the possibility of getting to against Pirate Warrior without winning. Like that's just a horrible matchup passage into evasion yeah but then i lose the possibility to win the game so like they surviving another turn there doesn't help me because that's my last passage now you're sailing on my seas. I, make my I already own. played the second passage so i couldn't hope for second passage
a good hand. Swindle helps. It's been a long time. I forgot Swindle was in this deck. I haven't drawn it in so long. Jeez. Go here and here. I just I do need to get like cards drawn. Got another brute. I can sacrifice the first one. In the box? Mm, if I don't hit something better. really get an inexpensive Myra's, which is helpful in this matchup. Faster, you kill all I don't think now is the time for an evasion. Nor do I really gain anything for extorting that. I need a lot of combo pieces still. I might need to like Someone's gotta lead the charge. What I really need to do is dodge a captain here. Doesn't matter where the cannon shots go, the uh good god. Danae, thank you for the gifted sub. Appreciate the generosity and appreciate you guys patching that up. Okay, this is probably the evasion turn. Prep. Evasion. Point secret passage to find some more card draw here. Oh my god, no. There once was a man from Gilneas. Play hopes. Job done. They've already had the cannon shots, right? Yeah, they just had them. So, could be at 15, the foreseeable future. That means, most importantly, that means the evasion stays up. So much for that. Bid starts at two hundred gold. A fair trade. I just have to be Myra's next turn. I didn't need to hit three of the pieces. But at the moment, it's the only way I can survive. And actually, it's not even enough. I can't survive here. Because I can't. Wait, I can't. Mechathoon. I'm out of cards. I missed. 
Oh, uh, this deck does not... <laughs> just doesn't work in the Pirate Warrior. And unfortunately, I've queued into 60% Pirate Warrior with this deck after not queuing into any of the past, like, three streams. Or hardly any. Okay. I think I can beat uh, Questline Hunter a little bit easier. But, god, this is the first Hunter with this deck. Which is a much better matchup than Warrior, which you've hit 60%. I need card draw still, though. Yeah. Got the old action Jackson. I think I'm still just going to trade this because, like, floating mana isn't good on turn one. Monk is not bad. Just need to find an activator for this is my main concern right now. Like, Jackson is a little bit better later in the game when she can fetch the remaining pieces that you need. In this case, like a uh, Mechathun. Don't use the coin here, it's just not good. Not the time for an evasion? I heard someone today say, Pirate Warrior is easy to counter, stop whining. Uh, if that were true, then it wouldn't be far and away the best deck in the format given how popular it is. Yeah, it, it's easy to counter if you play exactly Warlock or Questline Hunter. Mostly Warlock. But. That's a pretty narrow range of decks, if you ask me. The sand is not doing a lot right now, is it? I mean, that said, it's still just too early for these, so... An evasion... The turn prior to the Tavish, and then cloak the Tavish. Like, again, I still just need to find... I can even freeze the Tavish. Evasion is very good in this part, though. The dynamic to try and counter Pirate Warrior and Questline Hunter is what kills me. Yeah, that's what. That's why they're three playable decks in the format. That's like that's what kills the diversity in the metagame is that you have two oppressive decks that kind of cover each other's uh, weaknesses. Lethal limbs. Thank you for the five months. I think this is actually the time for the evasion, right? Because if I evasion here, they may not be able to get the Tavish in hand. That means they that slows them down two turns, right? Because then on turn five, I wonder. yeah, I'm just going for it. Right, this. There's two combo pieces. Might need to use the broom for the uh, minstrel activator next turn, though. Nope. Use the brain freeze. Missed uh, three damage there, so pretty good for me. I don't think I want to prep anything this turn. There once was a man from 
hits are not the hits I wanted, but like two cards further into my deck. I need a Secret Passage and the Myra's Megathune. Peace. A lot of peace. A very little card draw left in my hand. I need to just eat the damage next turn and then cloak after that. So this is the turn that I need to be able to draw cards, so hopefully I'm draw cards. Nope. This is gonna make it real tough to win. Jeez. Uh yeah, that's GG. Miss both swindles, uh Minstrel whiffed, didn't hit a shiny finder. Grew really poorly off of the um Give me that. Not what I want. Yeah, I can't win from here. There is uh unfortunately not enough time. Unless I can do something goofy like top deck Myra's, I can prep Myra's and uh, prep Cloak. Prep Cloak, prep Myra's. to do this here. I should I shouldn't have traded the one that I hit off the top. I could have had an extra card in hand and out of my deck more importantly. That buys me two turns. <laughs> there are combo pieces in there somewhere. Deck is only Cutlasses. No, there's extortions in there too. Don't be silly. I actually I want to leave that on board, so I need to freeze it without killing it. Is why I played it the way I did last turn. It always hits the mecha thing, right?
top deck the Myra's forehead. They didn't have the flare either, which is a big deal. All that said, like, the real big deal is whether or not I have anything to attack into. I need them to play, like, a wound prey or an on the hunt. You had the flare? Th this is... This is a new low. Unbelievable. That is just unreal. I, I cannot I cannot believe that. I faced a like I didn't have a way to win even if I had top decked the Myros is the problem. I faced a lot of um a lot of quest line hunters recently that have made really poor plays, but like what was the issue with Flare? They missed lethal because of it. Because they could have cleared the secret. You asked for it. I make my own luck. We've got some card draw here. Uh, I think I'm okay into Ignite Mage, right? I've got two combo pieces already, but that's not really what I want. Cloak and to a lesser extent evasion make me good into ignite. I just go shiny into coin elf. Oh, this is a terrible matchup. Um pretty much unwinnable, right? <laughs> Depends on when the explosives hit. So hopefully early. Good start. Okay. This seems to be improving. I can go action Jackson into double trade with the Blackwater. Yikes, that's fine, actually. Wanna find Mechathune? Myra's works too. Maybe hit that again. Oh my god, we got the combo pieces. I just need to not die for a bit. Which, that seems possible. I just go here. I've got everything. I just need mana now. Excuse me, you are on fire. And health. 11 showings. I probably shouldn't leave myself open to dying here, right? This helps with the mana issue. Next turn I just go Anka Evasion. Then I win? I'm sorry, what is that card? <laughs> uh, did I just win this? Not yet. Explosive could still get me. But I can play around it, I think, because I have the extra mana available You're with the prep. Ready for this. Watch the oh, show I'll show them all. Yeah. I'm late. I'm late. Okay. Let's either counterspell, which the prep eats. Oh no, I actually need the prep here, don't I? Rep Myra's. I 
I'm out of cards. Coin here. I need to play another minion just to play around um explosive. Okay. We're safe. As long as I don't botch it. Kill this, kill this, kill this. Ooh! I did not think I had a chance that game, but... <laughs> My draw saved me. Ooh. Why does the animation for Secret Passage take so long? Uh, because it's like, because you don't see the cards, but the game thinks that it needs to draw me four cards. Is uh, so it's like the animation is happening. It's just there's in invisible cards being drawn because I'm out of cards. No! <laughs> we were about to drop below fifty percent pirate warriors. Alright, I'm bound to beat one eventually, right? No, I'm not. <laughs> oh my god. This matchup feels pretty unwinnable, but I said that about the Secret Mage, so maybe it's maybe there's a chance. Minstrel's not bad. Okay. That's something. And we've got the extortion. Just drop a cannon here. Like, I'm a rogue. I can't deal with a cannon. That's not a cannon. Why don't you listen? So frustrating, right, chat? I considered a hero power just to play around Captain, but I think it's that likely they have one right now. Trust the pirate's code. Yeah, prep swindle. Plunger. Well, I have to do this. Not the worst thing in the world. At least they don't have the second captain here. It's just gonna happen next turn. Pow, pow. I just wanna go here in hero power as it stands. And then start doing uh, Jackson things next turn. will reduce the cost of this and this. I want this, uh, the turn following the Rokara, I think. Faster, you kill all, Here I thought they might trade with the weapon. One card played.
we're showing. We need Nothing to save the cloak. Not looking good though. Didn't hit the Anka. Oh, just I'm just gonna start conceding to that matchup. It's just not possible. It's too much damage, too relentlessly. So no more warriors for me. Which unfortunately means I'm gonna concede fifty four percent of the games that I play. Because that's what, as soon as I queued this deck, I found all of the pirate warriors. I hadn't faced them all week, really. Valera versus the Zoth. All right, warlock something. Oh, I shall be opened. Still need card draw, though. I can't afford to, like, get cards stuck in hand. Here we go. Prep Swindle, Coin, Minstrel. Seems alright to me. What is it? Oh no. Coin that. Coin hero power that. Get off my board. Uh it's cute luck. Oh god, it's cute luck. That's so bad. <laughs> alright. They do take some time to get rolling, so. They're not as, like, relentless as, uh, Pirate Warrior, necessarily. Double Broom means I can waste one. I've got Prep Minstrel now. Meta is not kind to this deck. It's, I mean, it's just Pirate Warrior. Like, this deck is always bad into aggro, but, like, it's extra impossible into Pirate Warrior. Sacrifice. Yeah, that's that's a fair point, too. You could say the same thing about any deck other than the three playable, or decks of the three playable classes right now. Is it... Did I misread the deck? Is it not, uh... Cute? Nothing gets past no reason to stab here. I've got Prep Swindle Minstrel next turn. And Questline Hunter? I mean, Questline Hunter, this deck can beat. Um, I've only queued into one, and I got a really bad draw, but, like... Okay, I just queued... But like evasions and cloaks are pretty good in that matchup. That was a lot of cards in hand. <laughs> what? Guess I had other good hits. Yeah. Probably need to freeze that. Um, maybe not. Uh, that's a lot of damage. All right, let's see what we get here first. Patience, not bad. There once was a man from Gilneas. Possible, I'm dead here.
can't get left at one. One, two. So second evasion is no longer an out. I don't think I went from here. Not the card that saves me. I need to get the Anka down, but I can't because I can't play the Anka and the Sticker Passage and the Cloak. So, what we're gonna do? Got seven cards left. The left six. Let's get rid of this. Cloak or a way to draw it into the cloak. Polkelt not worth the guaranteed drawing Myris. Uh, Polkelt doesn't guarantee draw Myris. We also have a lot of shuffling that we need to do in this deck. Uh, I can't win from here because I can't even play the cloak plus the uh, Anka. Luke draws Mechathun, or Polkelt draws Mechathun, and then sometimes Myra's, or sometimes Anka. But that's very slow. It takes multiple turns to set up. Because you have to play Polkelt, Anka, and that's 10 mana total. And you have to not trade in that period of time. Alira versus Alira. Tremble before the might of the elves. I make my own luck. Swindle for prep and coin. Let's trade this. This is very good. None will survive. That is not very good. Job done. It's a combo activator on the next turn at least. Kind of want to save the coin just so that uh, can gain mana. <laughs> uh, but like the combo takes a lot of mana to get set up. So. Good use of the coin. Oh my god. Wow. Not a good use of the tracking either. I am fine with that. Give me that. Love what I want. 
We hit the Anka. So I just need Secret Passage and... Um, I'm glad I kept this broom. Just need Secret Passage and my... next turn. I'm free, and so is my curse. Uh, I can use the Jackson with the weapon to hopefully find the Myra's. for the uh, passage. Probably hold back spells here, right? The opponent, that is. the Myras. I don't want to give them things to attack into, that's why I held back the action Jackson. You'll need to run faster than that. But I also need an evasion, so. Not quite out of this yet. Evasion's good. That said, I probably... No, I have to save the passage for next turn. They get most seven here. a bummer. Fierce. Thank you for the six months. At least this one flared first. Yeah, that was <laughs> much less embarrassing for them than the first one. Okay, evasion early is not good against mage because they have ping. It's generally not very good early just because they get the board. Or most decks get the board against me. I'm just going to trade that. Maybe reduce the cost of the swindle. Job done. <laughs> That's not bad either. Uh, 
time for an evasion. And it's kind of clunky. But, like, I do have ways to beat um, Ignite Mage, but it doesn't look like that's what it is, so. Nothing gets past. We've got time, I think. Unless I get Dirty Ratted. That would be the concern. Dirty Ratted and um, Janus, because it looks like it might be LPG. No, but it's still probably Reno. Not a great evasion, but evasion doesn't seem like it's going to be that important in this matchup unless I'm just completely misreading what it is. Trading though. Oh, that's some card draw. And that is a broom. This has been announcing things as they're happening with Ruffle. Just need a broom. Pretty good. And I can always get the broom on the uh, Myra's turn too. So that was a really good action, Jackson. I just need to dodge like the uh, disruption, so dirty rats and whatnot. Mutanus happens next turn. They did just draw a lot of cards, so that's kind of concerning. The wrong one. Go here. Oh, this just leaves me <laughs> absolutely obliterated to it by uh, Dirty Rat, but what are you going to do? That's not it. It's reassuring. It's just broom and it's GG, right? Yes. Easy game. Watched it. Is about to scream. Almost gave me a heart attack. Hey, hey, hey. I have not botched this combo once today. I'll have you know. I have botched other combos today. <laughs> oh, hey, another mage. You asked for it. I make my own luck. Double swindle. Deck is much faster than I thought it would be. Uh, it can be. Like it can, it can stall out if it doesn't hit his draws. So, I'm 
Should make uh Wow. Job done. Alright then. Probably means it's secret mage. Very good explosive runes for me. Very good counterfeit coin as well. Okay. Um, ideally, the second explosive runes would hit the Anka. I don't know what's with all the secret mages we suddenly started queuing into. But I'm just glad it's not Pirate Warrior anymore. There's the Anka. Alright. Kind of running low on card draw, though. Need to find my gradable stuff. Excuse me, you are on fire. Or that. What's the play here? You're a power face. Deny the rig fair game. Seems alright. Next turn, I can brain freeze into Minstrel. It's a slow hit. Let's get the golden one counterspelled. Or not. There once was a man from Gilnaeus. Nothing gets past me. Okay. the fireball. Job done. Not much I can do about that. I cannot believe. <laughs> there is no world in which Mere Entity is the right card to be running in your Secret Mage deck in the current metagame. Maybe it was better just to... I mean, it was definitely safer to play the cloak, but, like, I needed to get the Anka down. And it's not... Like, I, it looked like I survived into Fireball Ping if I... If it weren't for... an outrageous card in their deck. Valera versus the Thunder King! I am the Slayer of Kings and Gods. I make my own do not think this is the hand for me. And the prep is a little bit worse when I have the coin as an activator, so I'm gonna mulligan that as well. Turn two, Minstrel. I could go here. One, two, then actually clear that. Give me that. Jeez. Not what I We're gonna be rich, chat. I don't want them to have a minion on board for the uh, whack a null. No. Uh, avoid that if I can. Anka early. Okay. We are drawing rapidly here. I'm not stalling out. Is that a uh, 
hog spine knuckles? Is that what they're? So I've got everything except the Myras. Double the power, double the star. Okay. That lines up nicely, but they're not Reno, so they're less likely to be running dirty rats, um, or dirty rat. So this is probably the opening for the Anka here. Oh my god. Like, I, I knew from last... I've been streaming a long time. I knew from last turn I had the Megathune in hand, but then as soon as I played the Anka, I'm like, wait, where's the Megathune? <laughs> and I had a panic attack. Oh, it is a ball. Okay. Marabi! I mean, that's just way too much value. Big starts at 200 gold. Iris? A fair trade. Iris? A fair trade. Iris? It's 13 damage coming at me. Iris? Dear God. I'm getting tired of saying this. Not where I wanted that to land. Bog spine. So I was right on the read. It's just the opponent's drawn so poorly, it doesn't really matter what their cards are. Okay. Go here. Here. Myra's? Okay. Next turn it is. If they have spells here, they can make a pretty ridiculous board, can't they? Not that it matters because, like, they win, but it's funny. Ah! <laughs> oh my god, what a turn. Oh my god, more? I just, as long as there wasn't a narrow bar, I was fine. I have the mana, right? Yeah. I'm out of cards. Your for victory is formidable. What's sharper? Your wish or your blade? Oh, they got a rattle gourd too. Our cards are a little lower in hand, or am I tripping? Okay, I <laughs> I noticed the same thing. I thought it was just because, again, I've been streaming for for five hours now, and I'm losing my mind. So, uh, I thank you, thank you for validating that. <laughs>
All right, I think I got to call it there. <laughs> um